Hey everybody, I'm PJ from Princess Craft RV. This is the 10 minute tour of the Tab 360 by New Camp. It's only 2,700 pounds and only 16 foot 8 inches long. Twin beds, really open space. You gotta see it. Let's get started. Now the first thing I like to talk about is how comfortable you're gonna be, whether it's 110 degrees outside or freezing. This is a small space, and there is an Aldi heat and hot water system in this, as you'll find in most New Camp products. If you're not familiar with that, it is a radiant heat, so not a forced air furnace, so it's gonna be very quiet, very even, and keep you super toasty in here. It also provides hot water whenever you need it, so great little system. Also underneath the seating, you will have an air conditioner that's gonna keep it super cool in here, even when it's 110 degrees outside. Like I said, it is ducted air, it is a small space, no problem keeping it cool, and it has a heat exchange, so if you wanna run electric heat, you've got that option as well. The best part? In the Tab 360 in 2025, it is all right here on one control. Very easy to operate. You can see in some of our YouTube videos all the details of how to operate this uh, control panel. I love it. All in one place, super easy. There's a few more things that will help you be comfortable in this. One of them is dual pane windows. This trailer has a window literally on every side. That's unusual in a trailer this size. These dual pane windows are gonna keep the cold or the heat out depending on what you're trying to accomplish inside. And if you open these windows, you get full airflow and you get a blackout shade and a screen. Not only that, windows on all four sides, but you can open this door and you've got a screen across the door as well. So. It is almost like being outside if you put all the screens up, open these windows. I love that feature. You've got a power fan in the roof, and I love it because it creates a breeze. It is reversible, so if you need to bring some fresh air in, that works as well. All of that makes this a super comfortable environment regardless of the weather outside. Speaking of comfort, you're really going to enjoy boondocking because this comes standard, that's right, standard, with a 180 watt solar panel, a 100 amp hour lithium battery, standard on the unit. You've also got a portable solar port. So if you needed more solar and you wanted to bring a suitcase model, park in the shade, just plug it in, put that out in the sun, and you're ready to go. You've also got a battery monitor on your phone, set up in the camper, super easy to see where you're at as far as power. All that's standard. I'll tell you about the upgrades on the power packages later on in the video. Next, let's talk about the kitchen because the appliances in here are plenty for this space. Now, a little limited on countertop space, let's call it like it is, right? Except you've got the stove and the sink right here. If you're not cooking, then Fold it down, you've got all that horizontal space for countertop. Let's take a look. This nice glass top opens up to give you a sink on the left and a stove on the right. Now, why did they do that? They did that to give you this five cubic foot refrigerator behind me. That's one of the things in a tab that everybody was asking for. So you've got a five cubic foot refrigerator. Just open this up. You've got a nice size freezer there. This is all 12 volt compressor driven, so it uses very little power and works great. You can carry plenty of food, and if you wanna cook outside, there is a gas port for setting up your own grill or camp stove outside. Lots of options here in this Tab 360. Let's take a look at the storage. Underneath this kitchen area, you've got two top panels. They look like drawers, but they're really not. This one is a small tip out. You may be able to store some sponges or something there. And this one really simply access. The storage starts down below with this really huge drawer right here. It's probably what, eight, nine inches deep. 
Right now it is full of all the cool stuff that comes with your camper. And then this drawer that's got a little cutout in the middle, kind of different, but it's got to go around the plumbing and you don't want to waste any storage space. The rest of this is a full drawer here. And down below, you have open space all around. A lot of storage down below instead of up above so you can have this nice window space. Now let's keep going because right over here, you've got more storage right above the refrigerator. And as we come around to this side, they've got all kinds of hidden cubbies. You've got a little bit of storage right here. I mean, shoebox size, right? And small drawer here and a larger one right here. Up top, this first cabinet is gonna be the microwave. And next to that, more storage and this open cubby right here. That really can hold quite a bit, just right there. But there's more. Underneath this bench to about right here, you've got open storage. All you do is lift this up, you've got access right under there. This side has plenty of storage by itself, but there's a little more right across from you. On the passenger side, storage cabinet here, another open space, and we're not done because in the back, you've got a center drawer on your nightstand in between these two sleeping areas. Of course, you've got the top of this, which I'll always have stuff that lives there. Another shelf back here, and on both sides, you have this cabinet that slides open. You know, it's not huge back there. It's about three inches deep and maybe four or five inches tall and runs all the way across the head of the bed. Great for all those things that you just wanna stash right where you're sleeping. One more piece that you can't see, there's an open space right underneath this seat so you can access it perfect for shoes, just dropping some maybe outside gear in there. I love it, so much storage. The outside storage on the new camp tabs is larger than it's ever been. With this full size tub in the front, you have the propane over here on the left. The rest of it, it's all storage. Pretty incredible, right? Now, if this tab has met your storage requirements, you're gonna wanna know about the bathroom. It's a wet bath, so it's a combination, of course, but let's step in. You are six foot four inside this tab. This comes down to about six foot. You've got a five gallon uh, tank underneath this cassette toilet. Super easy to empty. Again, we have great YouTube videos on that. If you wanna see how that works, I'm a big fan of that cassette toilet, so don't worry about that. You also have a rectangular sink behind the toilet, but easy to get to. And the best part, the faucet doubles as a shower head. Hangs up right here, two things in one. Now, when you have a trailer this small, that's important. Make everything do double duty. I love the mirror on the side. I love the elbow room in here. Guys, it's not huge, but it definitely does the job right here inside this tab 360. This trailer has an amazing 25 gallons of fresh water, 18 gallons of gray water, and again, five gallons on the cassette. So great for boondocking. With all that kitchen storage, they even added this really cool spice rack right in here. One of the highlights on the Tab 360 has to be this twin bed setup and how easy it is to do. It has the ratchet system on the back here. Just lift it forward, lay it down, drop this table, and you're ready for bed. It's super easy. And this side, it doubles as a sofa. There are a few more things that we have to talk about with this Tab 360. Everything we've talked about on this trailer so far, it's standard but you will find so many of the Tab 360s have the Black Canyon package. And that includes an upgrade to 380 watts of solar and tank heaters, so if you're in cold weather, keeps your tanks from freezing, also under glow lighting, which not only is kind of fun, but it's great if you're boondocking because if you're in a dark campsite, that can help you see your way around without blinding you. All great features. 
Another package you can add is the lithium upgrade. Now that's gonna give you 270 amp hours of lithium battery up from the standard 100 and it includes a 3000 watt inverter. That's gonna allow you to run everything on this trailer including the air conditioner, so gives you a tremendous amount of power. If you'd like to hear more details about the Tab 360, check out our full-length video on YouTube. I'm PJ with Princess Craft RV. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.